What's up everybody? I'm Madeline with Boardwalk and you're watching the Grievance Journal series. A weekly video series where we listen to you air your biggest grievances. Disclaimer, if you're seeking happiness, this video series may not be right for you. What we offer is a safe space to vent about all of the annoyances of the world. But before we dive into our very first prompt, you're gonna wanna smash that subscribe button. Just like the patriarchy. Now, without further ado, prompt number one. This week we asked you, what cliches are you sick of hearing? Here are the top 10 answers. Coming in at number 10, we have what goes around comes around. Aww. Does it though? I think we'd all like to think that the girl who bullied us in grade school is now paying for her actions in some way, but odds are she's somewhere drinking an iced caramel macchiato and making a passive income with her pyramid scheme. So life isn't always fair. Number nine, life is short. Is it? Seems pretty damn long to me. If life is so short, then why are there so many seasons of Game of Thrones? We're just killing time, people. Okay, number eight. Everything happens for a reason. I don't understand how. When I get like a speeding ticket. How is everything happens for a reason supposed to make me feel better? Yes, the reason I got the speeding ticket and can't afford groceries this week is because I was speeding. So thank you so much for pointing that out. I will be sure to keep it in mind while I'm eating top ramen for the fourth time this week. Ah, uh, number seven. Plenty of fish in the sea. What makes you think that I ever would want to go deep sea fishing. Oh no, some asshole broke my heart. Well, plenty of fish in the sea. Wait, how many fish are actually in the sea? Okay, yeah, there are 3.5 trillion fish in the ocean. I gotta wade through an ocean of 3.5 trillion dickheads? Pass, I am landlocked from now on. Number six, don't judge a book by its cover, then why is the cover there? If you shouldn't judge a book by its cover, it's got the wrong cover. This, by the way, is a book that you should absolutely judge by its cover. It is a grievance journal. You journal about your grievances. Seeking happiness? Well, fuck off. Good cover. Good book. All right, in fourth place, the grass is always greener on the other side. To me, the best counter argument for this cliche is Jennifer Coolidge's iconic quote in a Cinderella story. Droughts are for poor people. You think JLo has a brown lawn? Moral of the story, the grass is green if you're rich. Third place, ignorance is bliss. Hmm, yeah, must be nice to be a fucking moron. I deal with them often and uh, they seem pretty happy. Good for them. Second place, but my personal favorite. When life gives you lemons, Make lemonade. Uh, with what free time? I didn't ask for these lemons. I don't want lemonade. Now I have to go get the sugar, get the water, get the mixing supplies, take time out of my afternoon to make fucking lemonade out of lemons I didn't even ask for. In first place for the cliche you are most tired of hearing, it is what it is. You know, I'm actually speechless. This cliche is so dumb, I actually can't even think of anything to say about it. I think it just is what it is. <laughs> Alrighty, folks. Let me know in the comments which one was your least favorite cliche. Or if there was one that I left out. If you want your answer featured in our next video, be sure to keep an eye out on Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube shorts for the next prompt. And you can see your answer in next Wednesday's video. But in the meantime, air your grievances privately and grab a grievance journal. Available on boardwalk.com. Until next time.